He realized a tremendous insight. This is essentially the business cycle theory. It's never talked about as such in the textbooks. It was not only a theory of money and a theory of international payments, it was also a business cycle theory. It's a, it's a simple model. The banks pump in money, prices go up, there's euphoria, and something happens, they have to contract in this bankruptcy and liquidation. It's a very simple model of a business cycle. He combined that, Mises, with Vixel's, Vixel was a Swedish, Austrian, Swedish bombardier follower, combined that with Vixel's uh, analysis of interest rates and how if the, if the banking rate falls below the natural rate of interest or the, or the free market rate of interest, uh, there'll be inflation. He combined that and he wound up with, with a, uh, with a integrated, magnificent path-breaking theory of business cycle. <coughs> and, uh, essentially what it is, what it says is that an increase in the supply of money and credit through the banking system, through central banking, not only in, causes inflation, everybody will admit that, at least all the neoclassicals will admit that. Excuse me, admit that. It also causes other disturbances.